This patrol has an important mission, a position of the enemy's forces. Hey, look at that over there. <coughs> Take it easy, Sanderson. Just my hay fever. You saw that raccoon? Listen to the birds. There's life all around us. This soldier is so jittery, the slightest cough upsets him. His nervousness is understandable, though, because his unit has sustained casualties from chemical and biological operations. And the fact remains that a soldier's best protection is prompt masking without an alarm or command. Failure to mask quickly at the first indication of a toxic chemical or biological attack could be very serious. How's this look for a break? Yeah, it looks good to me. Got plenty of water, good cover. To protect yourself against chemical or biological operations and nuclear attack, you must know and use all of the protective measures available to you. Okay, men, let's take a break, but spread out and keep alert. For the purpose of demonstrating how a man must protect himself against these types of operations, members of a typical rifle squad will be used. Even though the actions which you will see in this film are authentic, it is not likely that all of them could happen to any one squad in such a short span of time. We have compressed time in order to show procedures which you must follow to ensure your survival. What is important is protection rather than tactics. Hey, Sarge, you gonna make it out of here? I think so. It'll be rough, but we'll make it. Men can survive the explosion of tactical nuclear weapons within a mile of the center of burst, protected only by the ground. Some of the effects of these weapons include blast, heat, and nuclear radiation. <laughs> 